do you have a process when you um when you write so I say, uh, so if you have the seed, so if you have a new idea now for maybe a new story, how, where do you start? Um, notebooks. Like I have, I have, have notebooks like on my desk, like surrounding me. Um, I, I start with like jotting it down, um, and then like just just loose stuff, raw stuff. Uh, from there, uh, you know, I might create a a folder and like make it official and it's in like the drop in like a Dropbox or it's in a Google Doc so I can go back to it. With a mock um, title like, or whatever, a loose title. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, so it's there so I can find it. Um, and then, but, but like if I am like working on a story, um, it, it really is about like, um, like, the initial overview of what the story is, like how I, I sum it up in a very short way. Then let me expand it out some. Uh, from there, I'm doing characters, uh, you know, like maybe some dialogue might come to mind. I'll write down the dialogue, you know, it's, you know, um, just set up like a scene. Um, but when I'm really getting into like that moment before scripting, it, you know, it's, it's, it's an outline. Is an outline and it could be very loose uh, or it could be like more it could be tighter you know it just depends on what the story is and i kind of have a, a like a game plan with the outline and from the outline i then uh jump into the script there was a few months um where i like i went to like a three a three tier outline process that was based off of with Cullen Bunn, um, he had a blog where he like broke down his outline process, and I just tried it out. I, I thought, okay, well, let me see what this is about. And it was phenomenal. Don't get me wrong, it was phenomenal. And I still kind of take some of what I took, like some of what I read from him and experienced myself with it, and applied it to how I how I now outline. Um, but I definitely believe in in outlining before scripting. Yeah, no, I'm the same way. I think as you're talking, I'm looking, you mentioned notebooks everywhere. Like I'm looking at the notebooks and little yeah. post-its and index cards popping out of them. Um, I'll do the same thing, man. I will I will jot down any mm -hmm. random idea that comes to mind. Um, I'll try to keep it in one book if I'm lucky, but it'll be all over the place. Yeah, And those that's my brainstorming phase. And then when I'm ready to commit and like, actually, if I think it's a story worth telling, then I'll break down and, and I'll write an outline and it'll be kind of, uh, I'll try to do it like prose form. It'll essentially be a short story. Yes. If I'm lucky, it'll be in order, <laughs> but it won't always be in order. It might be, you know, I'll bracket off or I'll put a big parenthesis over a paragraph or page uh -huh. arrows pointing it back to the beginning. Like it'll just be very loose. Um, and then if I can, when it, when it's kind of, when I've hammered away at that steel to where it's kind of getting somewhere, then I will either write it out um, consecutively or I'll, I'll, then I'll type it up. Okay. And when I type it up, it's like it's becoming official now because it's on yeah. there. And that's yeah. just that's the uh, product of the brainstorming random notes for however long I've done it, months, if not maybe a year or so. And it'll, when it's a full fledged, completed, typed up, maybe several page outline, which is my little short story, then I'm like, all right, now I, now I know I'm, I'm in for it. Now I'm going to try and pitch this and find an artist yeah. and work on it and crack into the script. But, um, well, yeah, once I type up the outline, it's, uh, we're full steam ahead. <laughs> game on. It's game, game on. on. Yeah. So that's cool, man. I feel like a lot of, a lot of creators have a very similar <clears throat> process. Some yeah. outlines might be, and I've only just started to get into the typed outline because I feel like mm -hmm. that acts for me. It acts like a third, fourth, fifth draft, I guess, after the handwritten part. So I'll type it up mm -hmm. and then I'll print it out and then I'll go through it again, mark it up, and then I'll clean it up on the on the Word doc and then I'll have it. Yeah. So I've, I would have gone through multiple passes, multiple connecting the dots and, you know, working on callbacks and other things that I want to get into you know the actual storytelling the meat of it so so i found lately that typing part definitely helps and i could see it helping going forward but 
I mean, in the past, you know, it just, uh, I might have just flown by the seat of my pants and just jumped right to the script if it's a short story. Uh, yeah. You know, there's no way, I don't think there's no way to do it. It's whatever works for us. 